All right, y'all. So, ah, oh, goodness sakes. We are getting ready to pack up from our vacation. We are still in our second vacation house. We leave tomorrow, which tomorrow is April 20th. <laughs> I'm like so lost. Oh. So, anyways. Again, I don't know how videos are going to come out and play out or any of that. I will just do my very my very best. Um, so, anyways, we have a lot to pack and do. Our van going to Shasta's house was, like, just such a mess. Like, I thought that we had things organized. It was just terrible. So, when we got here, Nathan brought, like, we literally brought everything in, even though we were staying three nights here. Anyways, so we're trying to get reorganized and get all that stuff done. I've done... Two or three. Oh, there's still laundry in the dryer. Oh my goodness, where am I gonna put all these clothes? Why are you me end up with so much stuff? <laughs> Anyways, I gotta remember that laundry. I totally forgot. Anyways, I've done two or three loads of laundry since we've been here. I probably have another load that I could do. I'm not going to. Um, so we had I didn't vlog at all yesterday, which was Sunday or today. We just totally enjoyed our time. One, I just knew that I had a lot of vacation vlogs. Um, but yesterday we did, if y'all know of the Bates family. Um, their dad, Gil Bates, has his own church and he's a pastor at, and it's in Tennessee. Well, that church is two hours from where we're staying here. Um, so we woke up early yesterday morning and we drove that two hours and we went to their church and we met them. And they are even better in person than what they are on TV. Absolutely amazing. Um, so we got to see most of the family, but we got to meet and talk to Gil, which was such a blessing. He... Like, we talked with him at length. He just really blessed Nathan, Nathan and I and encouraging us with having a large family and just reminding us that we are doing <laughs> what God has called us to do. Not that we needed that reminder, but his words were, next to giving your heart to Jesus, the best thing that you can ever do with your life is pour into your children and what a blessing they are. Um, and... It was, it was just really good and encouraging to hear, especially from someone who's been there with many children. He talked about the hard times and he, you know, all that. He was like, it's hard. You have many different children. You have many different personalities. It's not like they're all cut. I mean, they are cut from the same cloth, but they're all very different. <laughs> so we could just relate. It was just amazing, an amazing time. Anyway, so in this vlog, I'm going to show y'all our road trip home. Um, so I told you what we did Sunday. So we literally just went to their church and we came back to our rental VRBO and just had a good evening and we cooked dinner here and we had a game night. And then today we kind of just explored the area where we are. We went to Chattaloochee and we saw Soco Falls and I went to an antique store and I bought some stuff. Anyway, so Nathan's got to fit all this stuff back in the van. I'm a little scared. It's I don't know. So anyways, I'm going to show you our piles upon piles. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> Harper's putting <laughs> stickers on Kinley. It's really cute. But Kinley's just in a diaper right now, so I can't show you all that. Anyways, so trying to get the food stuff situated. We have gone through a lot of what we had, you know, brought and bought here. So I shouldn't have too much. Anyways, trying to get the clothing organized. That's our jackets piles. I'm trying to put all dirty clothes in one suitcase. Um... And then I put all clean clothes in here. So that is all situated actually. And I can zip those up. Except I have to get that other load of laundry. Darn it. Oh my goodness. Anyways. So pretty much all this is ready to somewhat be packed up. I'm going to go get that other load of laundry right now before I forget. But I pulled out everybody's pajamas for tonight. And the outfits that they're going to wear tomorrow. Um, for the car ride home. So anyways, as much as like, this has been so much fun, I really have not been like that, having that huge desire to just like be at home. I don't know, like normally like I'm ready. I mean, I'm ready to go home, but not really until today. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Like we've been on vacation for 10 days. This is the longest vacation I have ever taken, I think. Besides when Nathan and I were newlyweds. We did a two week trip. Yeah. Anyways, so it's been a ton of fun. Very exhausting, <laughs> very much well worth it. Oh, good morning, everybody. I'm like, I am so tired today. Like, uh, no, but these diapers can go in it. I'm like, so we've been rushing around all morning trying to get out the door and time to get Chick fil A breakfast because we have um, major priorities in this house, anyway. So we literally just have like the last stragglers to load up. And then we're out the door, so we should be out of here in about 10 minutes. 
Um, I was so busy this morning, I didn't drink coffee yet, so I'm sitting for a minute. Drink it as much as I can to get in me. That means I'm gonna have to go to the bathroom in like an hour. <laughs> Nathan's not gonna be happy. <sighs> so, <clears throat> on this trip, some of the kids, like towards the end, have come down with a cold. And I do believe I got it. So, this morning I've been like, Ooh. anyway, so, ready to hit the road. We are about seven hours away from our house without stopping. So, here's to hoping we get there before dinner time, maybe. It's 10 o'clock. Well, it's 9.50. So, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, we should get there right at dinner time, which is fine. Um, anyway, so, yeah, that's it. I'm so tired, y'all. I'm like, oh my goodness. I think I'm going to have a major vacation hangover. Just saying. <laughs> All right. So, everything looks so much cleaner than last night, right? <laughs> so, like I said, we just literally have stragglers. Like, I mean, socks, a shoe sole. Like, how does this stuff happen, y'all? I don't even know. Last stragglers here. Got to take out the garbage. And the last few things in the kitchen. And then we can leave. All right, so stop number one on the trip home. It's been about three hours since we hit the road. We got on the road right at 1030. We got breakfast at Chick-fil-A and it is one, well, it's now 152. We've probably been here for about 10 minutes. Filled up on gas, um, made everybody stop and use the bathroom. And I'm about to go back inside and get a cup of coffee. I didn't take my card in with me. Um, so making pretty good time. I don't know exactly where we are, but I think we only have about three, three and a half hours left. So. Maybe only one more stop, hopefully, since everybody went potty. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I didn't mention when we got to South Carolina. We're still in South Carolina. Remember, it's a big state, y'all. <laughs> All right, we're back on the road. It is 2.05, so it's been three and a half hours since we started the journey home. <laughs> yep, we're halfway there. I just looked up, it said three and a half hours, so literally what we just did. before we first stopped, before we stopped the first time. Anyways, and then he had a Coke. <laughs> not the smartest thing, it's not the kids. I have to go too. I should have gotten a smaller coffee. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, y'all can have a snack. Yeah, y'all can have a snack. So, still in South Carolina. Just same thing, just an hour later. Another potty break. <laughs> yep, y'all can have a snack. We're in Georgia. Well. had to go potty that's okay we're, we're doing good I'm just so done being in the van <laughs> are y'all done being in the van yeah we're almost there slowly but surely Can you say hi? Hi. Hi. Okay. Gotta stretch those baby legs. Let's sit here for a little bit. Drew yeah. wants one? I'm driving. I'm driving. I'm driving. Kenny, you gonna take us the rest of the way home?
we're home. Home sweet home. Oh, gosh. All right, everybody. So as you can see, we are home. So today is actually Friday, April 20 something. <laughs> Oh my goodness, 23rd? I feel like it's the 23rd. Okay, so we actually got home on Tuesday and it has seriously been a whirlwind since we've been home. Nathan and I were talking about it last night. Like, I just don't even know where we've been or what has happened. Oh my goodness, and I wish I could say we've been busy unpacking, but no, I still haven't done that. <laughs> actually, I've done half of it, like all the household stuff, but the two big suitcases haven't been done yet. The, all the little kids' clothes and Nathan and I's. So that is my goal today, is to get that unpacked. Um, so we just had some stuff to take care of around the house. We had to do major grocery shopping when we got home. I think we did that Wednesday. Nathan still had Wednesday off. So his first day back at work was yesterday. So anyways, we had a fantastic trip. <laughs> okay, sorry, the little kids. I mean, they follow mama and they're a little loud. Anyway, so we had a fantastic trip. So blessed by everything that happened on this trip. Um, it was just really good to get away and focus on some quality family time. So since we've been home, like I said, it's been a whirlwind. I actually have a few updates that I will give y'all in another video. Um, but anyways, thanks for coming along with us to our vacation. We're back to real life, back to all the laundry. I did laundry on vacation. Back to cooking dinner, <laughs> although I didn't cook. I haven't cooked since we've been home. Oh my goodness. Anyways, back to semi real life. Anyways, so I hope that you all enjoyed our vacation vlogs and our road trip vlogs, and we'll see y'all in the next video.